So today I'm doing a quick review of this IG cell phone stand. Uh, comes in this box, which is you know decent quality box. Uh, you can see in here, it says a little stiff, sturdy, and durable. Um, you know, it's packaged in this plastic. Um, so you know, it, it's 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 a pretty tough thing. You don't really need to worry about it being scratched or anything like that. But you know, the box comes in is decent. Um, <clears throat> so here's the actual cell phone stand itself. It's got this clip here. Now this, it loosens up, you know, back and forth. You screw this to basically tighten and loosen this down. So you can attach it to a desk, whatever else you might want to. And then you can actually loosen it or, you know, tighten it up with that. So you can really move it pretty much anywhere. Got these nice little rubber pads in here to protect your desk, which is good. Uh, you definitely want to see that. There's a little bit of give in it. So I don't know if you can see that. You can see there's a little bit of give in these pads. So, uh, which is nice because sometimes you have those, a little bit of uneven surface in spots. And so, a little bit of give specifically in this top one uh, just makes so that you're less likely to damage anything. So that's always good. Uh, this little card came inside the box as well. Shows that there's a 12 month warranty. Um, so that's a good thing, you know, and it gives you directions to their site. If you want to go ahead and share videos and things like that on their on their site, share reviews, uh, you can go ahead and do that as well. Uh, I'm going to go ahead and attach this to the desk, and I will show you how it holds the phone. And then I will uh, also show you just how stable it is, you know, as far as if you wanted to do video with it, uh, things like that. Uh, I'll kind of show you how that looks, so go ahead and do that for you as well. Okay, so I just attached this to the corner of the desk. You can see that's attached pretty pretty well, nice and nice and firm on there. This part here rotates, and and it's it's not it's it, it's a little stiff, but it's not hard plastic. It's a, it's a it's a firm rubber, and that's just to protect it so that when it bends, this part won't overbend at at some of the weaker points, which would be you know right where it connects in here. You can see the same thing at this end. They've got another one of those as well. That's a nice feature because it just basically just protects that weak spot so that that, that won't be an issue. Um, so that's a nice thing. So when you attach it, then you go, and this is actually really, really firm, you know, which is good. I mean, that's what you really want. You want this to be firm, tougher to move, because what that does is it basically enables you then to actually have your cell phone in a spot where it's not going to move, you know, once you actually get in position. So long enough arm, uh, then you can actually put this in a spot where it's not going to move uh, when you actually get into the position you want it to be in. Uh, so I'm just going to go ahead and tw twist this around a little bit and show you how this works. This is the actual holder piece of it. So you can see that there's a rubber part inside there. There are these rubber feet that really kind of hold that cell phone. Uh, so again, it's protecting the cell phone uh, while it grips it, and the rubber makes it so that it gets a nice firm grip on the cell phone as well. So I'm going to go ahead and take, this is my older cell phone, uh, S6 Active. I'm going to go ahead and attach that in here, show you what that looks like with that attached, uh, and just how stable that looks. Okay, so I went ahead and put that cell phone inside. It's in there pretty solidly. Now this is the thing. So if I, you know, bang this, you see that it'll, it's going to do some bouncing up and down because it's it's a longer neck, and so that's going to happen. So that's one thing you have to be aware of with these. This is you know this is not going to be something that's going to just be purely stable. Uh, there's going to be some bounce. There's going to be some things like that that are in there. So if you're going to use this for, you know, different purposes, uh, you have to be aware of that. You know. If you bounce your desk a bunch, things like that, there's going to be some some movement, some shaking, and things like that that might happen there. So it's not, you know, this perfectly stable thing that's going to just not move at all. There's going to be some 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 shake, even though it's a very, you know, a very stiff, you know, actual support, but it's longer. There's going to be some bounce, um, and so that's just something to be aware of. So you see that again, a lot of you know given to you know a lot of bouncing around there. Uh, once you have it in position. So, you know, depending on what you're planning to use it for, um, you're not going to have super stability with this. You'll have some, you know, but if you're if you're going to bounce things, um, if you're going to be you know, messing with the phone, things like that, 
Uh, there's going to be some of that where there's some shake and things like that that happens there. So just to be aware of that uh, as you go ahead and to, to get this. But overall, you know, it is solid. It's going to, I mean, I can tell it's probably going to last quite well. Um, and for most people's uses, with what they'll use this for, you know, kind of having it maybe sitting sitting a spot next, you know, maybe they'll have it attached to their nightstand to watch a show, you know, whatever else they might want to use it for. It'll probably work pretty well. I mean, it really does. It's very simple to put this, the phone in, take it out. It's got nice rubber grips. Um, lots of good things with this. So it, it's a very solid holder. Um, but as far as the stability, if you want to use this for, you know, taking uh, videos and things like that, uh, it might not be the best choice. So, yeah. Thanks. Okay. So I want to give you guys one more look at what this might look like if you try to do, do actual video with it, things like that. Got a little bit of paper on this side here, which will help you kind of see what the shake might look like. Uh, so this is on the desk, mounted to the desk. Uh, so if I'm banging on this a bit, you can see a little bit of shake that's happening there. You know, if I drop a few things on the desk, things like that, you can see a little bit of shake, you know, it's actually in, the, in this angle, it's mounted up. It's going over the top of my monitor. Um, so this is probably about the worst it would be, you know, in this position, you know, but you can see, you know, if I'm banging things, there's definitely some shake that's going on there. So just going to show you what that's like taking actual video.